thing Navalny, uh, by and large, is, is really known as, as being the opposition leader against Putin. Um, you know, for better or worse, you know, he wasn't perfect, but he was a, a strong anti-corruption activist, someone who very directly was willing to call out the, the abuses of Putin and the, the Kremlin regime. And I think we'll all remember that. And I, I hope that Russians inside of Russia and outside of Russia will work to, to continue that legacy and to, to stop the war um, in Ukraine as well. I think the main message for us is to remain angry, to remain outraged, to be, um, to come out, to speak up, to, to speak out, and to make sure that, you know, we don't make Putin the problem for our uh, Putinism, I would say, because Putin is going to go, you know, in maybe, I don't know, 10, 15, 20 years. He's not, he's not, uh, you know, immortal. But we need to make sure that his system that he's built, it's, you know, bloody corrupt system that doesn't become a problem for our children, that we deal with this. And to be able to deal with this, we have to be strong, we have to be brave, like Navalny was. He returned back to Russia right, you know, at the, uh, um, facing the danger, the grave danger of his life. And, um, you know, that's, that's, that's a, uh, uh, a pretty significant um, courage.